today we return to a long overdue series. It's one of my favorite series. I don't know why I stopped doing it for a while. But we are heading to Dover for race 12 out of 36 in the NASCAR of the game 2011 career mode. Um, it's been like a month since I've uploaded one of these. And last time, if you didn't see it, we had a double flip and one crash at Darlington. So definitely check that out if you haven't yet. Um, yeah, so uh, let's get into it, I guess. We got Dover. Uh, Alright, we're gonna try a new percentage of laps. See how that goes. Uh, yeah, let's do this one. Yeah, let's go scan it. Okay. I'm gonna qualify. Alright, that's good. Alright, so this calls Dover as a short track. There's kind of like that subcategory, like the like Dover, New Hampshire, Phoenix. Uh, there's another track that's kind of like, I, I think there's another track at least. It's kind of like a mile, and it's kind of in between the intermediate and short track thing. I, I call them the short intermediates. Uh, I don't know, I think there's a subcategory, but... Yeah. Also, the Michigan racetrack is not up near Lansing. <laughs> you know what they tried? They tried. It's on the other end of Michigan, but whatever. All right. Qualifying at Dover. Let's do this. And right, we gotta be Kevin Harvick's pole time with twenty four point seven nine seconds. We're off. Okay, you actually do need to look a lot more for these than it turns out I thought. Car's a little tight right now. Good even adjustment there, but other than that, it's fine. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Alright. And dry, break. Um, yeah, we're in the fence again. Qualify 30 second. Great. Alright. Sorry, sorry. Stay focused. Stay focused. Ah, dang it. Yeah, we are doing much better this time than I did. Have a got to your turn three. Thirty second. Oh my gosh. <sighs> All right. All right. We got work to do. We got a lot of work to do. Get underneath Bobby Labonte here. This card's really tight. He just wants to go up to the top of the track. Oh, yep, that was my fault. That was my fault. Throw a caution already. Yep, oh, yep, there we go. That's the big one. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. We're just going to turn in front of Daniel Kirkpatrick or Mark Martin or whoever that is. So I just came down in front of Keselowski. I thought I was clear, and then there we all go. Yep, that was Daniel Patrick. Okay. Alright, so this is pretty much just take two. Uh, let's try this again. Hopefully we get a little bit of a better start than, uh, than last time. Oh, jeez, okay then. Gonna get up into him. It's got speed. Oh no! Todd Bodine got into the back of and then Kislowski ran me over. 
We can drive out of it, but this car is a mess. Holy moly. So, hey, we'll see here. I got in Scott's speed, so, because I wasn't happy with him. And then I got him in the town for dying. I would have saved it because Lowski ran over me and, and just another pile up. Exits of the corners I need to I need to work on. Alright. Okay, three, two, one, we're off. Okay, okay, to the bottom, out of the way, Reagan. David Reagan. Three wide on the bottom. Need to break a lot more. All right. It's fine. Oh, no. Not again. Come on. Oh, wow. We're in the air. We are airborne. Okay. So what happened this time? He came up. To be fair, Martin, Mark Martin came up. It looks like from that view, Mark Martin came up, actually, so. Hey, it wasn't only Mark Martin moved up, I came down a little thinking he was going to hold his on, but he just came up. Alright, 7 out of 40. Out of the way, Ambrose. He's going to stay in the draft, and then Casey Kane is going to be a slow poke. Casey Kane's gonna be right there, and that got me loose. Four wide bonus. Alright, we've made up ten spots since the start. That's his lap of the race right there. I can Dale Jr. get out of the way. Alright, down to the bottom. Harvick is just flying off into the sunset here as I plow into the back of David Rudiman and Hamlin's gonna force the issue! Yeah, that's a caution and all! Come on. Oh, and we are inside of the wall. Why do they always slide up when I'm just trying to come down and I take out the cone and I'm slamming the paper wall and then crashing in front of everyone and then I break the wall? <laughs> great, great day so far. Great, It's been a great race. Uh, <laughs> they were okay to his damage. That is good. Alright, level 11. Out of 40. On the bottom of Kenseth, who went flipping over last time. It was him and Michael Waltrip who, like the two, flipped over. We are underneath a lot of cars here. Making big passes as we move Kurt Busch out of the way. Alright, Burton is going to kind of cut me off, but not really. Oh, we're into the wall with Montoya but and Burton, and I'm sideways. Holy moly, and Burton's checking up in front of everyone. I'm going to move him. All right, Harvick, way up there, and I thought I could tuck in line behind Jimmy Johnson, but I guess I can't. All right. All right, pass Montoya up to second. All right, get around Montoya on the apron a little. Raising into the corner. Getting big time on Harvick now. I think I've got a little bit of a rhythm at this place. And here I come putting up the fastest lap of the race. Making the pass on Harvick. Having to send it in deep though because of that. And I'm still going to be able to clear him.
Oh no, I hit the wall. Got a lot of air underneath the right front. Hopefully that didn't do too much to the suspension. I can only imagine that did, and uh, that is an open. Alright, Harvick, just go by me. Just, just go by me. Nope, okay, you can't even pass me through the corners. Great. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm going wide, wide. Hold on. There we go. Just try to run some laps and then see what we can do here. See how big of a gap we can build. Three and four is a little bit harder than one and two, but it's still cruising out here right now. One and a half seconds behind is Kevin Harvick. Nearly two seconds now. Just cruising around. Bobby Labine is going through the field right now. That's pretty interesting. Okay. I'm gonna... Okay, around here. Fastest lap of the race right there. I'm gonna hit the wall. Yep. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I can't push it that hard. But I still can't push it pretty hard. Dang it. Alright. About three second gap between me and Arvik. Breaking the throttle up, throttle up. Oh, the corner felt like I was gonna hit the wall there for a second. All right, halfway through the race, we are just cruising out here with a 3.2 second lead over Harvick. down here, slide up the track, Arvik's faster now, okay, see, I see, oh, but only by three one hundredths of a second, what kind of a hit to the wall was that, that's gonna bring out a caution, the walls are really buggy today, because look at this, right, normally I just brush the wall, look at this, <laughs> What wall did I hit? Oh, what kind of con what? Am I still in America? <laughs> We're gonna like the inside here. Okay, then Bobby Lombardi is just driving through the field here. Why did it put me this far ahead of them? I, I, I feel like I gotta check up a little. Into the back of Harvick. Alright, don't trampoline me again, wall. Get into him. Taking him to the wall. And here comes a bunch of people, and Bobby Wabani's hitting me. Okay. Hamlin, Hamlin, Hamlin. Don't make me do anything you, you won't regret. Massive run on the bottom. All the way up to the lead. They're going to cross me over here. Are you to block Jimmy Johnson here? We can deny Jimmy Johnson a win at Dover. That, that would be pretty good. So Arvick's 3-100ths of a second faster than me. And right now, it looks like we are on track to put up a faster lap 
Maybe not anymore. It's gonna be a close one. Nope. Oh, we did. We did. Not by much, but we did. By about three one hundredths of a second. Yep, I, I knew it was going to slide up. That's why I let out of the throttle. I got 28 out of 40. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. Yep, we're into the wall. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We got a 3.3 second gap over to Jimmy Johnson. So he's going to try to keep lead and not do that. Okay. Only lost about half a second right there, so we still have a good gap. I'm blowing it all. Okay. We're gonna need a new car after this. Just an entire new car. Not just a roll cage. We might even need a new driver. Why is this just sliding up now? I think the tires are Yeah, the tires are wearing. That's the problem. The tires are wearing. Alright. It'll become a little bit harder to handle with the tires wearing down, but that's fine. I have it on standard, so yeah. That's why it's fine, not too bad. At least I've improved a lot since qualifying. Qualifying was bad. Alright, 10 laps to go. We just need to try to... Uh, I'll just run it ten more times. There we go. Alright, nine left for me. Alright, well, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Alright. Four second gap. Back to Jimmy Johnson. About half the track to the lap traffic. Eight to go. Just gonna keep it cruising. We got a 12 race win streak to start the season. We're going for the all time modern era record. Can we get the most wins ever in a season? That'd be insane. Okay. We have to get 28. Seven seven laps remain. We might get ten thousand NASCAR experience points. That'd be cool. Hold on to it. Ooh, that was tight. All right. All right. Lap thirty-four. Now we got a four and a half second gap. Back to Jimmy Johnson. All right, nine thousand three hundred and sixty NASCAR experience points or NXP. I'm gonna say NXP from now on. Four point three seconds back to Jimmy Johnson. Here we have lap traffic on the front straightaway right now. They just crossed the finish line. They're going in the one and two. They're really far behind. All right, nine thousand seven hundred and ten NXP. We might be able to get to 10,000 this lap. I think we are if we lead the lap. If we lead the lap, I think we got it to 10,000. Did it come up to four to go, I believe? Yeah, this is five to go. 10,160. If I had four to go, NASCAR experience points, we have four laps remaining. Slides up the track off the exits. Three laps remain. 6.3 seconds back to Jimmy Johnson. This is just a dominating performance. Right when they enter the corners, I'm out of the corners. We have lap traffic here coming up shortly. We're not going to be able to catch them. Still, just want to point that out. I hit the wall again. Two laps to go. 
Just need to get this thing back around to the checker point. We might get 11,000. We are at 11,000 NXP. I think that's where it's going to stop. Alright, so right when I exit the corner, they enter the corners now. White flag in the air. One lap remains. And if you look on the... They just now showed up on that thing at the top. It's a massive gap. And here we come. Gotta work our way through three and four. One more time. And we will make it through the piles at the start. And the table will qualify to win it over. Alright, we've conquered the Daytona 500, the Monster Mile. Conquered Atlanta. We've conquered the desert. We've conquered <laughs> a lot of things. We've conquered Phoenix. We've done Talladega. We've, we've done, uh, where else, where else have we done? We've done Auto Club. The amazing comeback done Richmond I think that's called the action track or something done a lot of places and this is the 12th one So, getting closer to the next thing. All right, here we go. So, we won by 6.12 seconds. That's dominant. We led 26 laps out of 40. Kevin Harvick led 13, so that's, nine, that's 39. And then Ryan Newman led one lap. Oh, that, that's it. That's it. And apparently, it scores everyone behind... Uh, scores everyone behind Brian Vickers, the lap down, which, which finished... He finished eight. And no, David Reagan. Yeah, everyone behind seventh place finisher David Reagan is scored one lap down, and I didn't even lap them. Okay, then. You know what? That works. That 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 works. All right, now it's time to see the drivers standing the point standings here. Very cool. Um, so we have a 541-point lead over Jimmy Johnson. Now, first time Jeff Gordon has not been second in the points. It's Jimmy Johnson now. Gordon only nine points behind, so he can easily make that up in a bottle race. Um, but, yeah, so now, as we always do, we have to see how far behind the last place in points is, which is still Dana Kilpatrick, who is 1,628 points out from behind me. Yep, that's that's great. We have 14 races left until the chase. Uh, we have 2,315 points. We have the first and only driver to hit 2,000 points. So far in the season. So that's going to be it for this video. If you want to see more. Leave it a like and subscribe. Do all this stuff. And I'll see you in the next video. Which will probably return to another long overdue series. That I like and enjoy making.